This is the Mazda MX-30, which just made its debut here at the Tokyo Motor Show. It's Mazda's first ever mass-produced electric vehicle, and it's a huge step forward for the brand. Let's check it out. So it's called the MX-30, which is an interesting name to start with. Immediately, you might think of the MX-5 Miata, but unlike the MX-5, this is an all-electric vehicle. The only confirmed figure we have from Mazda at this time is that the battery pack is 35 and a half kilowatt hours, but several of our friends in the global media are reporting on the same performance figures. 141 horsepower and 195 pound-feet of torque with a total range of 130 miles. The rest of the MX-30's design is pretty wild, at least by Mazda standards. The face includes a much smaller grille than we're used to seeing from current Mazda products like the CX-5, and the headlights have this circular signature like they do in the Mazda 3. Along the side, we have this really aggressive body cladding to remind everybody that this is a big, tough crossover, but overall, it's actually pretty tiny. The roof slopes down very aggressively and features this color contrasting design, which I have to see against different colors to make a final judgment call on. But up against something like Soul Red, it could look kind of iffy. A quick look at the interior reveals many familiar Mazda cues, but with some new touches like the shift lever and the center console, which is pushed forward a bit and kind of floats. The materials are also more on the eco-friendly side of things, featuring cork and door trim that's made out of recycled plastic bottles. That's nifty. The MX-30 is scheduled to go on sale in 2021 with different variants, including the all-electric model here and a range extender version which features a rotary engine. That's the first time that's being used since the RX-8 went out of production. Lots more to come on this, but the MX-30 made quite a splash today in Tokyo.